Mission. The baby is healthy, but your body is very weak. I strongly recommend you to stay in the hospital and wait for the due date. My baby, I will protect you well. I promise. Yanto, help me. I don't want to die. I'm here with you. Yanto. The patient is in critical condition. Mr. Hu, please find mesh and umbilical cord blood as soon as possible. Otherwise, Miss Jiang might not make it through tonight. Yan Yan is in critical condition. We need your child's umbilical cord blood. Do you think my child's life is worthless than Tiang Yan's? Shut up! Don't you dare mention Yan Yan. If it weren't for saving her, I wouldn't have let you keep the baby. You better knock it off. If it weren't for me, the little bastard inside you would have been long gone. Jiang Yan, you vicious woman. I want you to rot in hell. I'd like to see who dies first. Do it. Baby, I'm sorry. I'm not good to protect you well. You're awake. My baby. Where is my baby? Chen Li. Calm down. Your child didn't make it. It's possible. You hide him, right? Where's my child? Oh, Hanto, you lied to me. Didn't you say my baby could be born safely? There was an accident. An accident? I just didn't want him to be born because he's in the way of your relationship with Chang Yan. Don't drag Yan Yan into this. You can only blame the misfortune of this child. Oh, Yan Cho, he is also your child. How can you say such things? Shen Li, please stop being unreasonable. Get out. I don't want to see you. Shen, please don't blame Yanto anymore. It's because of my illness that your child didn't survive. But I'm in so much pain. Yanto is just worried about me. Shut up. Jiang Yan, stop pretending. I really never wanted to harm your child. I told you to shut up. I told you to shut up. Shen Li, that's enough. You murderers. I will make you pay for this. Yan Cho, Ming Xuan just lost her child. It's natural for her to be upset. Let me try to talk to her and clear up the misunderstanding between us. But... Don't worry. Everything will be fine. If you need anything, just let me know. Shen Li, oh Shen Li, you're really foolish. I've already killed your first child, yet you haven't learned your lesson. And now you're pregnant again? What are you saying? My first child was also killed by you? That's right. I watched your child blow out of you and turn into a large red spot. It was quite a sight. Why? Why are you doing this to me? Why? Who gave you the right to block my way to take my place? You and your little bastard deserve to die. You're lucky this time. I spared your worthless life. If you don't leave, Yanto, next time you won't be so fortunate. You killed two of my children. I'll make you pay for it. And don't help! Yan Yan! Shen, if anything happens to Yan Yan today, I'll make your life miserable. If I don't do this, I will protect my child. Dad, 
I want to go home. Whoever bullied you, I'll make sure they regret it. Miss Wu, Miss Jung might need a second surgery for the injury on her neck. I got it. Yan Yan. Yan Cho, don't blame me, Shen. It's my fault that she lost the baby. Don't mention her. If it weren't for her, you wouldn't be hurt like this. I'll go find her. Shen Li, Yan Yan was being nice to you. If you don't appreciate it, fine. But now you've put her life in danger again. Isn't that perfect? She can pay for her sins. You. Well, Shen Li, I finally see your true colors. The person you are right makes me sick. Sick? Speaking of which, can anything be as revolting as Chen Yan? She told me that she's the one who killed our two babies. It's her who killed our two babies because children got in her way and she got married in her family. They are two lively wives. How careless she is. Shen Li, I find you are not only evil, but you are also an absolute liar. The thing happened in those years. I have verified it was you that colluded with that doctor to cheat me into marrying you. Now you want to use babies to frame up Yan Yan again? I was wrong about you. Holy angel. Two babies. Is it not enough for you to see Chang Yan's true color? Shut up. If you dare to say a word to slander Yan Yan, I will let you pay for it. We are too. Let's get the course. Divorce? Those days you begged me to marry. Now? You want to use divorce to reduce your sin? Go! Follow me to apology for Yan Yan. Apologize to Yan Yan. No way. Yan Zhou, don't make this hard to reason anymore. It's all my fault, and the one who makes you always worry about me. Chen Yan, you are such a great actress. If you are really very weak, why don't you just go to hell? How dare you to push Yan Yan? I had our babies, and you never care about me. But you, with Chen Yan, killed our babies. You know, don't you feel guilty at all? Yeah, Job, I can't really breathe. <laughs> yes, sir. Your baby's dead. That's an accident. If I'm dead, will you be happy? You're right. As long as you're dead. Then I'll be very happy. Shen Li, I'm about to lose my patience. I apologize. You better not play any tricks. So who I didn't give it out. I should have tried to sell the anger to Chen Yan. She is so weak. How about it? You go to hell. Then you can be buried with my dead babies. You must be crazy. How about it? You go to hell. Then you can be buried with my dead babies. Shen Li, you must be crazy. Yan Yan. Yan Yan! Doctor! Coming! Oh, Yan Zhou, you tremble on my dignity. When Dan Li were battering Jiang Yan up, you made our babies die for loving you. I almost died. Now, it's time to say goodbye. Where is she? Who? Chen Li? Miss Chen? How are you related to her? I'm her husband. No way. 
If you were her husband, how could you doubt know she was dead? What? That's impossible. She played any tricks on me, Sir, yeah? Please, calm down. She has passed away already. I'm so sorry for your loss. Shen. Without my permission, I don't allow you to die. Mr. Gui is coming. Mr. Bling's hands are on reach. It's a lucky to be in school flight. Yanto, the girl went in there. Seems to be Miss Shen. Stop it. She was dead. That's enough. Let's get inside. Yanto. Mr. Wu, it's my uncle's birthday party. Where will you bring me? She is so low tight. Do you look down upon the Gu's family? Mr. Gu, I'm Yang Zhou's fiancé. I heard that your wife just died. And now, you can hardly wait to bring your mistress here to draw people's attention. Don't you worry about that people talk behind your back? Who told you that? Kuyen. Shen Shenley. Shenley, I thought you have passed away. What? Seeing me still alive? Are you disappointed? No. Yanto and I are happy to see you alive. Since you are all good now, why didn't you go back to Huo family? Is it because of this man? Aren't you tired of this fake drama? If I go back, you lose your position. Kuti, let's go. Where are you going? Where are we going? Is it your business? Mishan, don't be mad at Yanto. You are his wife. Seeing you showing up in public, holding hands with another man, that's humiliation to him. You're so funny. When he was holding your hands in public, did he remember me as his wife? What? He has the right to cheat on me, but I don't. Shenley, stay with this fucking dude. That's why you fake your death. Stop talking shit. You just project your evil doings on others. You even sacrificed your own child for the sake of a mistress. Now you're pretending to be a victim. Gucci, let's go. Yanto, how can Yushan become this? Think about it. She's getting close to the heir of the Ku family. Is she using him to take revenge on you? The Ku family cannot defeat me. Shen Li, do you think the Huo family allow you to easy come and easy go? Without my permission, even if you die, you can never leave the Huo family. Okay, Bill. Mr. Shen, can you survive without men? I should ask you this question instead. You've been with him for years. He's still unwilling to marry you. You! You are a slut! How dare you slap me! I only slap beast. Sorry, Mr. Shen. I shouldn't have competed with you for Yanto. Shenley, what are you doing? Yan I was just talking to Mei Shen, hoping she could forgive you, but she slapped me suddenly. Shenley, Yan Yan is weak. How dare you slap her? If she's really painful, tell her to die. She will be painless when she dies. Mei Shen, do you hate me that badly? You're causing me to die? Yes. I have chosen a tomb for you, only when you are available to be buried. Shenley. If you are going to walk out of this hall alive, apologize to Yan Yan right now. How dare you bully my family member? President Huo, 
On the dinner party of Goo family, you are bullying my family member. Looking down on Goo family. What do you mean your family member? What's the relation between you two? This is the family affair of our Goo family. It's none of your business. You should be a decent visitor if you can't follow my rules. Please leave. My girl, today, Daddy will introduce you to everyone. From today, whatever difficulties you have, Daddy will protect you. Hello, everyone. Today, on my 50th birthday, I have important news to tell you all. Is that the woman holding hands with the heir to Gu family in front of the hotel hall? Yes, I saw. Sir Gu is touching her face. That was not the way of treating his nephew's wife. God, this girl is so calculating. She can hook up with both the uncle and the nephew of Gu family. They even allow her as a mistress to show up in public event. We are wrong. She wasn't going for Ku Chi. She was going for Sir Ku. Shenli, you are such a slut. You can't deny it when you grow old. The future of Sea City depends on the young people. I found Shen Li from Stanford. From today, she is the CEO of Gu Group, in charge of all affairs of Gu Group on behalf of me. I'm still a newcomer. I don't understand a lot. I will be grateful for your kind instructions. Miss Shen is such a talent. I don't know what she did to make Sir Ku trust her that deeply. Is it what the rumor says? Stop. Sorry, Yan Cho. I was talking nonsense. Maybe Miss Shen has extraordinary talent. Serve the dishes, please. Enjoy the food, everyone. What are you doing? Boy and Joe, because you refused to pay my project, I couldn't pay my son's medical fee. He died of pain in hospital. Today, I will let you know how it feels to lose your loved one. Your target is Ho Yan Zhou. Why are you coming at the innocent one? Let Xiao Li go. Innocent? She's the wife of Huo Yan Zhou. She gotta die. You got the wrong person. Huo Yan Zhou doesn't love Xiao Li at all. He cares about this woman. Yan Zhou. Let her go. I'll pay however high price you want. I don't carry that woman in your hand. If you don't trust me, just try to kill her. Huo Yan Zhou. Are you a fucking animal? Do it. Huo Yan Zhou, you are so cold at this critical moment. Huo Yan Zhou is choosing another woman over you. I feel sorry for you. But I won't let you go. You should blame your wrong choice back then. No! Shen Li! Ho oh, Yanjo, if anything bad happens to Xiao Li, I will kick your ass! Anything between Shen Li and me is not your business. Mr. Gu, you shouldn't blame Yan Cho. It was unexpected. Also, Mi Shen is the wife of Yan Cho. Why does Mr. Gu care about her more than Yan Cho does? Shut up! You are just a man poucher hidden at the corner. You don't deserve to talk to me. Yan Cho! Gucci, you are too nervy. I haven't blamed you for what happened between Shen Li and you. How dare you yell at me? Crap! Shao Li belongs to me! Who is her family member? Me! I'm her husband. How is she going? The surgery is successful, but she's weak now. Needs to stay at the hospital for further examination. Either of you come with me for the registration for her hospitalization. I'll come. Shen Li, every time you show up, why do you steal Yanto's attention away? Are you feeling better? Kuchi, I need some water. The relationship between Miss Shen and Mr. Ku is really good. It's more relaxed on Yanto. So you still know that Huo Yanto and I are a legal married couple. After all, you two are almost going to bed in front of me. Miss Shen, I did not. You misunderstood me. Shen Li, Yan Yan's mind is much cleaner than yours. Not like you, who only uses your body to achieve goals. Huo Yanto, you make me feel disgusted. You cheated on me and tried to blame me. I don't want to see you for one second. Divorce immediately. Divorce? How dare you mention divorce to me? Yeah. 
since you love Chang'an so much. How can you let her bear the curse of the mistress? I had forced you just to fulfill your desire to be together. Chen Li, stop making many excuses. You want a divorce? Isn't it for this man? Xiao Li, don't be angry. It's not worth it for such a person. The doctor said you shouldn't get too emotional. Don't even think about divorce. Here in my case, only widowhood and no divorce. Even if you die, you can only be a ghost of the Kuo family. Mission. It has been less than a month since your last C-section. You're not well enough, and just before, your back was also injured. It would be important to take care of your health. If not, then you might suffer serious complications. Don't. Anything wrong? <laughs> Let me feel you. Just stop. What is the big deal? We had made it. Chiang Yan had been with this doctor. Hoi Anto, so pity. Unknown to you, Chiang Yan has been with others. That's what you get. Chen Li, Chen Li has found us. Everything will be done if she told Hoi Anto what she saw. Not a big deal. I'll fix it. What are you doing? Get off me! Get off me! Shenli, Shenli, Shenli. Everything will be fine if you're well. Shenli, Shenli. Don't worry. We now have been in the hospital. Brother, Sister Yan Yan was injected with some unknown liquid, and she is not well. She needs an instant operation, but the hospital is short of blood supply, and it could be late to get blood from another hospital. Shenli, could you please? Why, Anto? Once again, you wanna draw my blood just for Chiang Yan, right? Whether she lives or dies is nothing to me. But no, Yan Yan. Please just look at me. Not only she would die because losing too much blood, but also me. How could you be so selfish, Shenli? Just draw some blood. Why don't you agree? Moreover. Now she is sick, and that's all because of you. Even she wants all your blood. You have to accept this result. Take your blood now. Take your blood now. Stop. Huo Yan Zhou. I promise as long as I am still here for Xiao Li, you could never hurt her. You. Xiao Li, see the doctor and take it easy. I'll go and buy you something you want to eat, okay? I don't want to be injected. I need to change another doctor. Do you think you can run away? Who the hell are you? Person wants your life. Ah, ah. Stop, you bitch! Sholi! Brother, help. Sholi! Sholi! Shelly, you're awake. Brother, someone wants to kill me. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. It's all my fault. I'll be with you from now on. Consecutive accidents. It must be related to Chang Yan. That day, I saw she had an ambiguous demeanor with that doctor. It's not like a doctor and a patient. Brother, go and check it out. Chang Yan's interpersonal relationships at the hospital. The faster, the better. You suspect she's in collusion with the hospital staff? Okay. I'll go now. 
you need to rest a little longer. Those outside are all my people. I will never let Ho Yan Zhou's mistress and that doctor hurt you. Like your secretary comes to me. Stop! Shenley, you wicked woman. You can still sleep? Do you think those people outside can stop me? You hurt Yan Yan. You must prepare bearing the consequences of harming her. Yan Zhou? Yan Yan, why are you here? You haven't recovered yet. You should take a good rest. I'm fine. I'm just worried that Miss Shen will do something foolish. So, Chang Yan, you are really insincere. Miss Shen, what bad things I did on earth. You hate me so much. Must I die? Yeah. I can't even dream of you dying. Shen Li, enough! You murderer. How dare you be so arrogant. Yan Yan asked me to let you go. Or do you think you can lie here and sleep with peace of mind? What? Chang Yan said again that I harmed her? The doctor who operated Yan Yan yesterday. He said you gave him a large amount of money. Hu Yan Zhou, you are such a fool. You believe everything that doctor says. Was he possibly bribed by someone to frame me? Just as you said, I also can say it's Chang Yan who asked the person to kidnap me. Mi Shen, I know you don't like me. But for the sake of Yan Zhou, you did something wrong. I won't blame you. Shenley, you don't have to argue anymore. There was an extra 500,000 yuan in the cart suddenly. It was taken from your account. Hey Shen, don't make trouble with Yanto anymore. He travels around for my illness. He is really tired. Is it you who hurt me? It's not important anymore. After this critical illness, the doctor said I have not enough time left. Sign this for a donation agreement. I will give you 500 million yuan. Hoi Anto, you want me to die? You did something wrong yourself. Five years of blood is not too much. Twice a month. Do you treat me as a blood bank that cannot be drained? You should eat more nourishing blood. You can make up for it. Hoi Anto, you're such a jerk. You dare to drain your wife's blood for your mistress and kill your own baby! Two babies! Demon man! Shenli, stop! You heard it, Yan Yan. It's reasonable to compensate her. And I will pay you 500 million. Then you could stop selling your body for sex. Oh, Yan Cho, you son of a bitch! You know nothing about it. And for what? You concluded that I sell my body? Get out of here! Be Shen! If you are angry, just hit me. Yanto, don't travel with Shen anymore. Compare with my grudge. I prefer to no quarrel. Yan Yan, I'll make you safe. I promise. Shen Li, if you don't sign the papers, do you know the consequence? Oh, Yanto, if you force me to draw my blood again, do you know the consequence? Shen Li, your arrogance now isn't as the supporting of the Gu family. I shall see without the supporting. You still dare to be arrogant? Well, let's wait and see what happens. See who was destroyed first. What a wicked scheming bitch. How dare she hit my brother? Sister Yan Yan, she need to pay for it. What can we do? I want revenge for my brother. Mission is brilliant indeed and adorable. But. She have a bad private life. If it spreads, that's no good. Sister Yan Yan, I asked Juan Kan to hook up with Shen Li. I do have made research. He is good at womanizing. I will help you to give her a lesson. Who are you talking with? Where is Shen Li? Where is she now? Brother, it hurts. Let me go. Listen, Huo Anan. If she was in trouble, even if you are my own sister, I will never forgive you. She deserves it. 
Where the hell is she? Where? Where? Wow, Miss Shen. You are so pretty. Are you good in bed? <laughs> if you dare to rape me, Go Family won't let you get away with it. Who Family asked me to do this? Without it, how dare I? Huh? You mean Hui Anto? Who else if not he? Hui Anto, you whistled your way to get a blood donation from me for Jiang Yan. I hate you. Stop it! Who the hell are you? Shen Li. Miserable. I'm sorry. That's my fault. Please don't punish me. Don't let me see you in High City again from now on. Hoi Anto. You make me sick. You dare to ask that man to rape me. I know that dead lost to compel a woman like that. Don't lie. He'll do anything for Chiang Yan. Enough. I doubt. Are you Chiang Yan's lackeys? Enough. For your sake, stop testing my limits. If you won't, that happens again. Just sign the blood donation papers. Why, Anto? That's impossible. Then you need to stay in this room for the rest of your life. I want to back to Goose House. It wasn't illegal imprisonment, remember? We are still couples in law. It's special means at the most to try to protect my marriage. We should get divorced. I cannot stand you even one second. Divorced? And just let you marry to your Mr. Goo? Never even think about it. Huayanto! You bastard! Juan and where is the bracelet in my security cabinet? What's Miss Shen so anxious about? Is it from someone important? Shen Li, what's wrong with you? You lost your bracelet. How would An An know? Shut up! Juan and I've asked the mates. They said that you're the only one who's been in this room. I didn't touch your stuff. Brother, help me. Shen Li, what are you doing? Let go of An An. Shen Li. What's wrong with you? How does An An know about your bracelet? It's not when I say not. Who cares your jade bracelet, that kind of thing? Even a dog wouldn't want it. When did I say that it is a jade bracelet? Hoyanto, you had someone rape me. Your sister stole from me. It's not like a family doesn't go into the same house. Huo An An, tell me the truth. Where did you hide the bracelet? I... I sold it overseas. Why, Anto, you're calculating yourself. Her sister Huo An An stole my bracelet. Her family are all perverts. Shen Li, how shameless you are. You're no longer wanted by Anto. Why did you come back? Do you think I want to come back here? But you, Chiang Yan, without any identity and honor, lived with Huo Yanto for so many years, but well, I don't see how much he loves you. But for me, Yanto will drain your blood and cut out your child alive. You're really evil. I'm evil. No matter how evil I am, Yanto still loves me. He loves me so much, he can't help it. All his heart is with me. The stuff I abandoned, take it if you want. But it's a pity you've always been the mistress without status. That's so pathetic. I should have let you and Cam torture you to death, you bitch. You did it? Why 
Now you know it. Is it too late? Ah, ah, Shenli, don't kill me. Yunyan, what's going on here? Shenli, do you want to die? It wasn't me. It was Jiang Yan who got herself with a knife. Would I believe what you said? What kind of character is Yan Yan? What kind of character are you? It hurts. Are you okay? I'm fine. I just came to see Miss Shen. I didn't realize it was all my fault. I shouldn't have upset Miss Shen. Anand, take your sister-in-law to the hospital. Shenli, come with me to the blood transfusion room. Even if I have to drain all your blood today, I have to save Yan Yan. I am told, let me go. Let me go. Today, even if Jiang Yan dies, I won't do it. You snake-hearted woman. How many times did Yan Yan take risks for you? What about you? Even if you die today, it's worth it. Why, oh, Anto? No matter what happens, why do you always refuse to trust me? Trust you? How dare you ask me to trust you? What kind of character is Yan Yan? What kind of character are you? What have you done before? Don't you know? Yes. Jiang Yan is kind-hearted. And ruthless. But it's a pity. And ruthless feeling. I didn't kill her with a knife. You want to die? Why not to? Kill me if you're so capable. It's a good thing I'm dead. You can let Jiang Yan die together with me. You want to die? It's not that easy. Today, I'll do it by myself. I'll drain all your blood. Let go of me! I won't! Let go of me! Don't move! Why, Anto? Why are you taking my blood? I don't owe you anything! I have no reason to save Chelia! Let go of me! Hurry up, take it! Is it enough? Maybe. Shen Li, you're still alive. How dare you come here? As the victor, why wouldn't I dare? Oh, yeah. Look at the mess you're in, sympathetic. Why doesn't Yan Zhou feel sorry for you? One day. I'll make you all go to hell. That day may not come. After all, you'll die before me. What's this? This? Doesn't it look familiar to you? This is blood drawn from your body. So, you're not sick at all. You lied to Huayanto. No, I didn't lie to Huayanto. I lied to all of you. That imprisonment two years ago, I never had leukemia. I was just trying to make Yanto hate you completely. I just made up an excuse. That's why you said you needed umbilical cord blood. It was also a lie. Yes, that's right. When the baby was born, I was right there, watching. He was healthy. It was a boy. One strict guy that just came out of my room. That's why I had like a doctor. Your son got killed. He's probably into his pain. He kept crying. He cried so much that his body turned purple. Really poor. My baby.
Jianghan, I'm going to kill you. <laughs> I'm going to kill you! You cannot take it anymore. This is just the beginning. As long as you don't divorce Yanto, I'll torture you for as long as I can. If you don't divorce him, I'll torture you for the rest of your life. Open your eyes and see how I put your dirty blood into the drain and mixed it with the excrement. Make Yanto drain your blood. Let's go. Why did you call me help? What did you say? I said, make you happy enough. <laughs> Are you crazy? Let go of me. Yanto, Yanto, help me. Shannon. You crazy person. Let go of Yanya. How could he? Okay. I'll call. I'll call him right now. Make the call! I know. Call your turn. Let's divorce. Don't think that just because you're divorced, you're not responsible for what you did before. What I did? Voyanto, you're really deaf and blind. I wish you to be in Farto. Xiang Yan will have many grandchildren. Gently. I'm telling you, Hui Anto, we have nothing to do with each other. If you dare to pester me again, I will forgive you and Xiang Yan. Shaoli, let's go. Shaoli. I'm fine. Brother, I won't get involved with Hui Anto anymore. As for Xiang Yan, she killed my two children. I won't let her go. I've checked out Jung Yun. Her background is clean. I can't find out anything at all. Then we'll start with her past. Okay, I'll handle this. By the way, I have some good news for you. What good news? Gu Group has found a new investor. Guo family won't be feared anymore. When the time comes, you'll see them as the Gu Group's heir. I'll take you shopping at the auction. Good. This auction item is from the 19th century. It's Wittels Bach Blue Diamond. It's made by a top French designer. The base price is 20 million. Yanto, the auction has begun. The highest bidder will get it. Begin! How beautiful this necklace is! I'll get it for you. 30 million. 30 million, Mr. Guo. 40 million. Mr. Gu, 40 million. 50 million. Mr. Huo, 50 million. 60 million. Mr. Gu bid 60 million. 100 million. Mr. Huo bids 100 million. 170 million. 170 million from Mr. Gu. 170 million going once, 170 million going twice, 170 million going thrice. It's a deal. I am very shame. Senku gave her the big cool drool before, and then Master Goose spends a fortune on her. How lucky she is. That's enough. Stop. You're so fond of exchanging flesh for profit. Huo and Zhou, speak with respect. Huo Anto, what happens between me and Pu Chi has nothing to do with you. Don't forget we're already divorced. Mishan, I thought you and Yanto are divorced, but you were once in love. You should still respect Yanto at some extent. Mirshan, I know you hate me because of Yanto, but why did you hit me? Yanto! So what? Is it wrong to hit a mistress? You just picked up a second hand that I threw out. 
What are you so proud of? Shenli, show some respect. Don't talk like a shrew. It's true that Miss Jiang is not a shrew. But she's just shameless. She's a mistress after all. The same to you two. Wait until I'm warning you for the last time. We have nothing to do with each other anymore. Stay out of my business. Mr. Go, why did you buy Mission such expensive jewels? Is it because you like her? There is a rumor going around that Mission is close to the Wu and Gu family and the Wu group. May I ask, which one is your sugar daddy? If you don't know how to talk, then shut up. Since you have so many questions, I'll take this opportunity to clarify. Firstly, Huo Yanto, the CEO of Huo Group and me, we used to be a couple when we got divorced yesterday. We have nothing more to do with each other. Second, as for me and the Ku family... Mission is quickly clinging to the Ku family. Are you trying to marry into the rich family again? Bullshit. Shaoli is my cousin. She's my uncle's biological daughter. She's a member of a wealthy family herself. How can that be? Then why isn't her last name Ku? I took my mother's surname. Is there a problem? Okay, I'll be right back. Shaoli, I've got some businesses. You go home first. Shenli, why did you hide your identity from me? Huayanto, even if you cared about me a little bit, you wouldn't regard me as a woman who sells her body. Mishin is pretty impressive. She is actually the heir to the Ku family. Then Mishin should know that a marriage between the Hua family and the Ku family could lead to many projects. Then, why did you hide your identity to get close to Yanto? Hua Yanto, don't mess with me again. Mishin is now the heir to the Ku family. Her life will get better in the future. Yanto, shouldn't our marriage be on the agenda? Yan Yan, I told you, I've always treated you like my family. Yan Cho, what do you mean by that? Yan Yan, you're not well right now. I met a good doctor abroad. Why don't I take you abroad for treatment? You can settle it down there. No, no, Yan Cho. When I saved you before, you promised to take care of me for the rest of my life. You cannot break the promise. I've been waiting for you for ten years. Yan Yan. I promise you, I will definitely take care of you as your brother. I don't want that. Yanto, I beg you. You cannot leave me, Yanto. Yan Yan? Yan Yan? Mr. Huo, the surgery was successful. It's just that Miss Jung's body is too weak at the moment. She can't be further stimulated. Okay, I got it. Good. Yanto, am I dying? It's not a big deal. Just a small problem. Yanto, I know I'm not well. I don't expect you to marry me. But I don't want to go abroad. I just want to spend the rest of my life being with you all the time. Okay. Let's try to get engaged first. Let's go on a date first. Yanto, look. Is that Miu Shen? It doesn't seem to be Kuji sitting opposite her. Miu Shen, long time no see. Mission, although you and Yanto are divorced, but you two used to be a couple. It's just to say hello to each other. There is no need to make such a mess of it. It's just to say hello to each other. There is no need to make such a mess of it. Ho oh, Yanto, mind your own person. Yan Yan, enough. Mission, don't you want to introduce them to me? It's just an unimportant person. Shenli, this gentleman, Shenli is my ex-wife. Lu Zhisheng, Miss Shen's dating partner.
This gentleman doesn't look well. Exercise more often. Huo Yanzhu, you're done with the greetings. You can leave now. Mie Shen, although you and Yan Chou have been through a lot, but it's over now. Yan Chou and me are getting engaged. I hope you'll come and give us your blessings. When will you have the funeral? I'll go then. It's not too late. Mie Shen, I thought that after you divorced with Yan Chou, you have let go of what happened before. No. It seems that you still cannot forgive me, can you? I'm actually going to die. Your wish will be fulfilled soon. Shen Li, don't go too far. Hoi oh, Anto, we're the forced. Don't you ever tell me what to do. Mishan, I'm sorry. It's all my fault. I shouldn't have interrupted your date with your new lover. Since you're a mistress, you should have kept a low profile. Shen Li? Don't push yourself too far. If you don't get out of here, I'm not sure I'll do it again. Mr. Lu, ah. I'm going home now. Ah, I'll walk you home. Yan Chou, you're eluding me. Yan Yan, I've told you I've always treated you as my own sister. The wedding you want, I can't give you that. Fu Yan Chou, are you in love with Shen Li? I'm not. You saved me ten years ago. I'm really grateful to you. But love is not something you can control. I'll give you a hundred million and the shares of Huo Group for the rest of your life. You'll have nothing to worry about. No. Yan Chou. If you don't marry me, I will die in front of you. I hope you can respect my decision. Yan Tou? Oh, Yan Tou, since you love Shen Li so much, I'll kill her so you can come back to me. Today I invite you all here in order to announce something. The lady next to me, Miss Jiang Yan, is my god sister. She becomes a member of the Huo group from today. She will enjoy all the privileges of the Huo family. Today, I'm going to give her a check for 100 million and 5% shares of Huo group. God, Mr. Huo is so spoiled her. Holding a meeting in person in order to claim a god sister and to declare her identity. Presenting a check for 100 million and Huo group's 5% share to this Jiangyan. Is that real? With Huo Group's current valuation, 5% of the shares is an outrageous price. This generosity is not the way to treat a sister, right? Could it be that she's actually a mistress, not a god sister? Yan Chou, you know what I want. Yan Yan, sign it. The two of you, such a wonderful scene. Why don't you wait for me? Mie Shen came here uninvited. You're not taking me and Yan Zhou seriously, are you? Miss Chiang, I'm here today to attend your engagement party with Mr. Huo, but I didn't expect it's turned into a family confirmation party. It seems Miss Chiang's tactics are nothing more than that. Mir Shen, I know you hate Yan Chou because of the divorce, but Yan Chou and I are completely innocent. It's definitely not the kind of relationship you're thinking of. Chiang Yan, it doesn't matter if you deny it. Although you're not having an engagement party today, I've prepared a special gift for you. Why did you bring the police here? Hi, Miss Jiang Yan. We're from the Heisung City Police Station. We're here to arrest you on suspicion of intentional homicide. Here's our subpoena. Please come with us immediately. 
What are you talking about? I don't understand. I wonder if there's a misunderstanding. There must be a misunderstanding. Why would I do something like that? Shen Li, I know you don't like me, but you don't have to frame me on purpose. I'm not that boring. Since you won't admit it, I'll show you something good. Since you refuse to admit it, then I'll show you something. We were wrong. We didn't mean to kidnap you. Please don't take us to the police station. It's not our fault. It's all Jiang Yan's fault. She's your husband's mistress. She paid me to kidnap you. Yeah, we just took the money and did what she told us. Oh my goodness, Jiang Yan turned out to be a mistress. She wanted to kill the man's first wife. Ah, oh, she's so vicious. How malicious she is. It turned out she was such a bad person. You go to tell Yan to say that I'm critically ill. If suitable, umbilical cord blood cannot be found. I won't leave through tonight. Yan Zhou? Jiang Yan, won't you admit your guilt? Yan Zhou, you must believe me. I don't know anything. I've done nothing, really. Jiang Yan, why did you lie to me? You think I look like an idiot, don't you? No, I didn't. I do love you, Yan Zhou. Is this your love? Your love is really terrible. Miss Jiang, please come with us to the police station right now. What do you want? What do you want? I'm not leaving, Yan Zhou. Yan Zhou! Shen Li, she slandered me! I'm not leaving! Baby, mom finally revenged for you. Poyanto, from now on, we'll never see each other again. Brother, please save Sister Yan Yan. She lost so much weight in the police station. She brought it on herself. Sister Yan Yan did something wrong, but if Shen Li hadn't provoked her and stimulated her, otherwise, Sister Yan Yan is too kind to hurt her. Huo An An, you have no right to accuse Shen Li. She never meant to hurt you. But you, you teamed up with Jiang Yan. You almost murdered her. But Shen Li didn't have an accident. Brother, you must negotiate with Shen Li. After you were kidnapped 10 years ago, his sister Yan Yan not only saved you, but also got her parents kidnapped and killed. She became an orphan from then. You owe sister Yan Yan all these things. 10 years passed. I paid her back what I owed her. But she didn't. She killed two of my children. If you don't save sister Yan Yan, sister Yan Yan said she's gonna give those videos of you from 10 years ago to the press. At that time, Huo family will completely become the joke of the Hesu group. How dare you help an outsider to threaten your biological brother? Sister Yan Yan knew you wouldn't help her, so she had to do this. Brother, please don't blame Sister Yan. Well, well done, why not? Get out of the whole family. Sister Yan Yan is right. Brother, don't let that fish friendly deceive you. Shen Li, we must have a talk. I have nothing to talk about with you. Can you drop the case for Jiang Yan? Poyanto, do you know what you're talking about? You're asking me to forgive someone who's tried to kill me numerous times. As long as you agree to give up the lawsuit, I promise you, I'll do my best to help you develop overseas markets. And I'll give you a third of Huo's shares. You won't lose a penny on this deal. Poyanto, you're really ridiculous. 
the woman killed two of your children. How dare you beg me for her? I'm sorry. You made me sick. Shenli, you've just entered the Goose House. You need these projects to stand on your own. Hoi Ancho, what a good person are you? Okay. What if I release her, but she continues to revenge me? I promise you, I'll take good care of her. Must you save Chiang Yan? Yes. Okay, I agree. But I have one requirement. That is... You go to hell! Shen Li! As long as you want to save Chiang Yan so much, how about you give up your life for my two kids? Don't be emotional, okay? I'm emotional? Each time we have an argument, you think I'm emotional. But you saw the fact that you fool have been used by Chiang Yan all the time. Shen Li, sorry. Hui Anto, I don't understand you. You love Chiang Yan so deep to this extent. She killed your two kids, but you have not even a little thought about revenge and beg me for her. I must be blind at times to fall in love with a man so disgusting and vicious as you are. Shen Li, please listen to me. I don't want to. Get out! Right now! Get out! Shen Li. Mr. Huo, don't bother my date with my girlfriend. Your girlfriend? You two are being together? Or what? I am not you. I will not wait for a dead man. So, Mr. Huo, please don't bother our date. Mr. Lu, your eyes are very beautiful. Is it? You are alike one of my friends. He is a doctor. It's a pity that I am only a merchant, full of the smell of money. I'm not sure whether I can pursue Miss Chen. Of course. Oh, yes. Five days later, there is a charitable banquet. I don't know whether Mr. Lu is interested in being my partner or not. My pleasure. Pardon me for picking up a phone. Hoi Anto. Let me go! Say, have you already involved with Lu Jiexing long before our divorce? You are so indecent! Do you think everyone is the same as you? Don't change the topic. Tell me. Besides Lu Jiexing, how many men have you involved with? A football team. You! So you two have already had sex. But why he would invest in the Gu family and help you to compete with the Huo family? You beast! Am I wrong? Recently you took advantage of his capital and network to take totally three projects of the Gu family. Is it not your aim? I'm telling you, whoever is able to insult me, but you are not. In order to marry you at that time, I have given up to be a Miss Ku. You plan to drain my blood to save Chiang Yan. Poor Chiang Yan, you cut out our child alive. If you still have a tiny piece of conscience, you shall not appear in front of me. If I don't appear in front of you, should I allow you to be involved with your lovers? Who do you think you are? As a murderer? Who kill your own child for your mistress? Don't digress. The child's death is just an accident. That is not an accident. It is a premeditated murder by you and Chiang Yan. Impossible. I will never kill my own kid. You don't believe me. So...
I asked doctor to choke him alive. He was probably too painful. Crying continuously and his whole body become purple. This. Oh, Yan Chong, do you know how deeply I hate you? Do you know how strongly I wanted to kill you when you asked to drop the lawsuit? You are not eligible to be a husband and a father. When I was still your wife, I have suffered from Jiang Yan's torture and entrap. And you have always stood by her side unreasonably, and insulted me with her, even tried to kill me. I really want to ask you, when the kid was cut out alive, were you very happy? The kid died, and your loving woman could be saved. But, why Yanto, have you ever thought about our kid? How strongly he wanted to survive? How he wished his father could protect him? I don't know. I really don't know. It is Jiang Yan who lights me. She has never told me these things. It is not important. My baby is dead. Nothing can be changed even after you knew. But I want you to remember, it is you who killed him in the flesh. I'm sorry. I, I'm really sorry. It was not me. I won't accept your apology. I will let you live in regret in your whole life. Hoi Ancho. You truly have never loved me even a little. Brother, have you talked to Shenli? Has she agreed to drop the lawsuit? No. Shenli has snatched the whole group so many projects and still be angry. How could she be so selfish? Please, talk to Shenli again. If it doesn't work, our whole family will directly unite with all the group companies of Song and the annex of Gu family. Why do you have to get Jiang Yan out? It's for those videos of yours. Well, tell Jiang Yan. Not only will I not let her out, I will also find the best lawyer in the world. I want her to die in prison and never get out of it for the rest of her life. Brother, you! No! Once the videos were spreaded by the media, Hua family's image will completely ruin. You will also get kicked out of the Hua family. Then let her do whatever she wants. Whatever. I only have one purpose now. I want her dead. Hey, be gentle. I got it. Please come this way. Alright, let me have a look. These are not enough. Song Yu, how about this? You go buy some more quickly. For both boys and girls. The quality must be the best, you know? Okay, hurry up. Hello? Help me. What is
is your purpose in approaching me? To get revenge for your Jianghian? You know who I am. Aren't you afraid the Ku family will know? Jianghian just a pawn. Tonight, I want to show Huo Yan Zhou what you look like underneath me. Let it go! You let me go! So beautiful. You're indeed Huo Yan Zhou's woman. Are you okay? How dare you touch her? Ho Yanjo, I tell you, I want to steal not only your woman, but also everything out of you. You court death. Ho Yanjo, I tell you, if you weren't from the Huo family, what do you think you are? Shenli, are you okay? Let's go, bitch. Hello. Get Jiang Yan released on bail pending trial. Get her out now. Are you sure you don't need any more checks? You've asked seven times. Oh, Yan Zhou, you got divorced already. What happens to me has nothing to do with you. You haven't eaten anything tonight. I'll get you some. What are you doing back here? I said you don't need to make up for it. Shen Li! Jiang Yan. How did you come out? It was Yan Zhou who let me out. It's impossible. He couldn't have done that. I can't help it. I'm pregnant with his child. He naturally wants me out. Oh, yeah, Zhou. Shen Li. Do you know how embarrassed you look right now? Yan Zhou loves me so much. Once I crook my fingers, he can't wait to hold me up. Isn't it normal to be pregnant? Then why are you here now? Show off. You have to force Yan Zhou. You should keep your distance from him. Don't seduce a married man. You should take that to heart. Yan Zhou and I are true love. In love. Those who are not loved are the third party. I'm not like you. All you do is flatter. I advise you not to think of ideas. Or I will make you feel the pain of drawing blood. Shenley, I'm back. I bought you coffee and lots of snacks. What are you doing here? Eat something. This is your favorite snack. Come on. Can you stay away from me? I don't like the things you touched. If you feel guilty, please get out of my life. No way. You can only stay by my side. Why, Anto? Why do you say that? Isn't it Jiang Yan that you love? Now you're in front of me. Why are you like this again? Get some rest. I'll come back tomorrow. Yan Cho, I miss you so much. Jiang Yan, how did you get out? I'm pregnant. It's yours. The lawyer released me on bail pending trial. Is it mine? Did you know there's no relationship between us? It's yours. You did that. 
You were drunk before. You went to my room and forced me. I remember. Then let's live well in the future. Don't you have any common sense? A drunk man has no sexual ability. Can it be my kid? Yanto, I cannot be without you. You are the father of my kid. Jamya, you better go away from me, or I will make you die. Hey, send me some money. Wasn't the bracelet last time just sold for 30 million? I'm sure the time it is. You've run it out again? Just a bit of money. It's not even enough for a small gamble. I don't have any money now. A bit shows up in my way to marry into whole family. Don't worry. Just waiting. I'll kill her for you. Didn't I tell you to just kill her? Why is she still alive? How dare you tell me what to do? You want to get beaten up? You don't want the money, do you? My dear girl, it's daddy's fault. Please forgive me. But sweetie, don't you recognize this girl? What do you mean? Ten years ago. Didn't I kidnap two rich kids? She's the girl. Hai Sung's old family. The only daughter of the head of the Gu family. How's that possible? Tell you. You're his daughter. Dad, we're going to get the ransom. As long as she's still alive, doesn't it mean there is no delay in the transaction? Yeah, as long as we keep her alive. What are you doing? What? Shenley has been kidnapped? They want 100 million ransom? Yes, the Wu family is raising the ransom. Right now, I want you to find out where she's been kidnapped. Yancho, I didn't expect that you could find this place. How did this man get in here? Ask yourself. You cannot even monitor a person. Is he Huo Yancho? Yes, but based on the current situation, I won't have anything to do with him anymore. Dad, after we get the ransom, just kill this couple, burn the corpses and destroy the evidence. Jiang Yan, what's the relationship between you and the kidnapper? Jiang Yan is the daughter of this kidnapper. It's impossible. Are you surprised? Because I'm the daughter of a kidnapper. I couldn't have saved you from the trouble ten years ago, could I? The girl who was rescued at that time was kidnapped along with me. You are right. But have you ever thought about it? I wasn't the one who saved you? The one who really saved you is right next to you, don't you remember? It doesn't matter anymore. Chang Yan, let Huo Yan Tong go. If anything really happens to him, he could get the money but have no chance to spend it. No. I won't let either of you go. Don't you guys catch him quickly now, if you catch Huo Yan Tong, and then ask the Huo Family for a ransom, you won't have to worry about the future anymore. Haha, <laughs> that's right. You leave quickly. Yanto, you go. I said you go now. Oh, Yanto. Ah. So 
you want to run? You really underestimate yourself. Let's play slowly. Look, Koyanto is not resisting for you. Koyanto gave you ten years of good life. And that's what you did to him. It's your fault. If it weren't for you, I would have been married to Yanto and become a wealthy wife. It's you. You took my place. Arrest this bitch now. You! Don't come over here. Otherwise, I'll strangle her. Shenli, how dare you! Let Huayanto go! Let go of my daughter! Let Huayanto go! I'll kill you! Shenli! Daughter! So, are you all right? I'm okay. Shenli, I must kill you. Shenley, what happened to my brother? Why isn't it you who got hit by the car? If it weren't for saving you, my brother wouldn't have been hit by a car. Say something! Why don't you say a word? Say something! Why don't you say a word? Say something! Why don't you? I am too. Surely. 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 Brother. Where is Huayanto? How is Huayanto? I heard he's still in the surgery. How are you feeling now? Do you feel well? I'm alright. Huayanto. I need to find Huayanto. Surely. Please calm down. Stop. You are not going anywhere today. Dad? I've heard about what happened to you recently. Huayanto deserves to die. But this time, he's doing this to save me. He owes you. I won't allow you to have any relationship with Huo Yanzhou. You must recuperate here. Get ready to get married. Getting married? Uncle. He wants you to marry Lu Jiecheng. What? From now on, you are not allowed to have any relationship with Huo Yanzhou. You can just stay here and prepare to get married. I won't marry Lu Jiecheng. He's a bastard. You have to listen to me this time. I won't choose the wrong person for you. Impossible! I will never marry him. Shaoli, please calm down. Brother, let go of me! Listen to me, okay? Sir, just now the hospital called. Mission signed the surgical agreement. The current situation of patient Huayanto is very serious. Mission also needs to sign a risk notification agreement. Risk? W what kind of risk? The success rate of the surgery is only 30%. Whether the hospital should give up the surgery or continue, it's all up to his family member. Don't give up. I I'll sign it right now. Shaoli, please calm down. Calm down, okay? Brother, please let me out. Dad, just let me out. Chi. Please keep an eye on her. Don't step out of the house. Dad! Okay. Shelby. Brother? How is Voyanto? The surgery finished and he has been transferred out of the ward. Brother, I beg you, please let me go to see him. Just one glance. Uncle, he doesn't want you to have any relationship with Ho Yan Jo. If it weren't for Ho Yan Cho's credit this time, I would have died already. You must finish watching him soon and come back immediately. Okay. I'll give you 30 minutes. After your visit, I'll pick you up. Don't move. The one will crack open. I'm glad you're okay. Ho Yan Cho. We're already divorced. Why did you still save me? I know I've done a lot that hurt you before. 
But Shenley, I really love you. After experiencing so many things, do you think I can still believe in you? Who's I tell you, asshole? I'm not done with you from last time. How dare you show up? Well, of course I want you to fall in love with me again. Lu Zhisheng, what did you put in her? I didn't inject her with anything poisonous, don't worry. It just makes people obedient. After being injected, she'll be like a puppy in a second and behave like it. Lu Zhisheng, you asshole! Lu Zhisheng, what the hell do you want? After what Hu Yanzhou did to you, don't you want him to become a cripple? How was that, Lu Zhisheng? Do you touch her? Lu Zhisheng. I told you to let go of her. Let go of her. Beg me. Okay. I beg you. What? I can't hear you. I beg you. Hmm. Look at Huo Yanzhou. Does he look like a crippled dog now? Huo Yanzhou, I didn't think you'd have a day. The honorable member of the Wu family has had this day. Well now, I'm taking your woman with me. Goodbye, <laughs> Lu Zhisheng. Damn it! Get back here! Get back! Dad, is he really my boyfriend? Why can't I remember anything? Yes, he is. You are crazy about Jiaxing. You've been trying to marry him. I never agreed, so you ran away from home. You got into a car accident and hit your head. Am I right, Jiaxing? Yes. You are my boyfriend. But why am I a little afraid of him? We love each other. Baby daughter, don't worry. Since I agree to your request, I'll give you to a big wedding. Is Grandpa scary? I'm a little nervous. No, he isn't. Grandpa is kind. We're here today because Grandpa wants us to have a grandchild. Shenli. What are you doing? What are you doing? Yo, dude. How come a trip to the hospital makes your eyes weaker? What are you doing? What did you do? She's my girl. That's none of your business. Don't you know we're engaged? Did you say yes? Let go of him! I can't believe you're protecting him. Have you forgotten what he did to you? What he did to me is between me and Ted Tang. None of your business. What are you doing? You can't kill me, and Shenley will hate you even more. Hit me if you dare. Stay down. You're being ridiculous, Bianjo. Stand up! Are you alright? Apologize to Chen Cheng! Apologize? Ask him. Do you dare accept my apology? Hu Yanzhou is indeed the old man's favorite grandson. If we keep doing like this, I'm the one who suffers. Shelly, it's okay because we are family. No need to apology. Brother and I just had a little argument. But he hit you so hard. 
Shao Li. Lu Zhisheng, you'd better not touch a single hair on Shen Li's head, or I won't let you go. Wrap up the mood. Dinner is almost ready. Mr. Huo, are your legs alright? Yeah, it's nothing serious. Zhisheng. Yes. Xiao Li's father is coming straight to our house. You have to treat them well. I will, Grandpa. Xiao Li, my hand hurts. I want a cherry. You are so great, Xiao Li. Song Yu. Back to the room. What are you doing? You are hurting me. Don't go. I stay in the hospital for a whole month. Why don't you always come to see me? Why should I come to see you? Are we friends? Don't you know me? I know you. You're Chi Cheng's brother, the... The president of the Huo group. What's the matter? Chen Li, we need to talk. I got nothing to say to you. Could you... could you lay off me? Do you really not remember me? I actually lost a little memory. But my physical reactions tell me that I really hate you. So, could you stay away from me? You hate me? Ah, the president of the Huo group actually thinks about his sister-in-law, Hu Yanzhou. Do you want others to laugh at you? Why did you... Why did you just forget me? Or remember him? Because I love him. But you, I don't really remember you. Brother... People's brains have a protective mechanism. People always forget those miserable memories. You should ask yourself, what did you do to make Shen Li hate you so much? So you greatly disgust me. I don't really understand what are you talking about. I don't believe you loved me so deeply in the past. Love you? My lover is always cheating. My father also say that, Mr. Huo, in the future, can we keep a distance? Well, I think your family also don't want to spread about scandal. Jiaxing, Shaoli, Sir Huo and I, we've discussed your wedding date. It's in two months. Take advantage of this period. Prepare yourselves well. This marriage... I don't agree. You're not qualified to sabotage Li's marriage. Sir Huo. It seems that the Huo family's rules are nothing at all. Huo oh, Yanzhou, what are you talking about? Can you behave yourself? Grandpa, Bruce just sick. He's just a little bad temper. Uncle, you may not know. I won't allow Shen Li to marry him. Sir Huo, it seems that because someone is here today, it is impossible to talk about this marriage. Shao Li and I will leave first. Stop right there. What do you mean by that? You leave. Shen Li stays. You have no right to talk. What are you doing? What are you doing? Dad! What are you doing? What are you doing? Dad! Give me back my daughter. Hu oh, Yanzhou, what are you doing? Hu Yanzhou, what are you doing? You misbehaved. Get out right now. Mr. Huo. Miss Shen loves me. You can take a horse to the water, but you, but you can't make her drink. Cheqing! How dare you touch my woman! Who's your woman? You just lost your memory. He's a rapist. Even if he is like what you said, I still love him. Huo Yanzhou, you bastard! You love him? Then I'll make him be a cripple today. What are you going to do? Oh. 
You're a bastard, son. You don't deserve to talk Play to Anto, me. let me go! You cannot hurt him! One more sentence. I'll make him suffer ten thousand times. Even if you beat me to death, Shenley won't love you. I don't need her to love me. I just need she's by my side. You're a dog nut. Get me out! Impossible. You can just stay with me the whole life. Hui Anto, what's the relationship between us? Why are you always tangle with me? I can't be responsible for what I've done for. Give away from me! What you touched is so dirty! Oh, very good. I tell you, we are a couple. I did many things that are bad for you. I also can't forgive myself. But I beg you, give me one more chance. We can be together again. This time, let me chase you. No. Why, Anto? Who are you to say that? Who do you think you are? As for moral quality and personality, Chicheng is better than you. He is tender and careful. But you, heartless and cruel, and you are disabled now. How are you to say you can chase me? I'm disabled, but do you know why my leg crippled? I don't have the interest to know. I just see the result. Disabled is disabled. You can never change it. Good. Very good. But have you ever experienced being fucked by a disabled man? How about here? Get the hell out of me! Has he touched you here before? How about here? Here! He touched, he touched every skin of my body. So your touches just made me sick. I just love Lu Zhe Cheng. Shen Li, why? Why you just forget me? Mr. Huo, Miss Shen jumped through the window to find Lu Zhe Cheng. Send someone after her. Yes, sir. I want to be the master of the whole family. You didn't be killed last time. So you think you are strong enough now? I trade you Shen Li for it. What do you think she is? Your soft spot, of course. Get out. I don't have time to talk nonsense with you. Now, Shen Li is amnesia, and the one she believes most is me. If I bring her to somewhere, she can't go and make her go through something she didn't deserve. Hey, do you think it's interesting? You are dead meat. If you don't give the place to me, I will do it. Why Grandpa called me back? He just wanted me to be the master of the whole family. The whole group doesn't need a disabled man to be its host. I can give up the whole group to you. But I need Shen Li to love me heartily. I can give the whole group to you. But Shen Li should be willing to come back to me. Okay. Soon, Shen Li will fall in love with you completely. Shen Li. I have something left in Hua Shi Club. The room number is 1608. Can you help me get it? What's it? You'll see when you get there. Okay. Frost on the shoulders. Wind and cloud and lightning. Goodbye, the sunset. Excuse me? I'm here to help people get things. Miss Shen, you've got a lot on your plate. Several days ago, we just touched you. What do you mean? Hu Yan Zhou, get us out of the high soul. You forget it? The owner of Huo Group have changed. 
Hoi Ancho, what do you mean? Ho Yan Zhou is nothing. Go in, go in. <laughs> Let me go. Let me go. I'll give you money. I'll give you the sum you want. I'll give you money. There will be someone give me that. We just want to fuck you today. <laughs> Let me go. Let me go. Brother Yuan, Brother Yuan, how about strap her up? Then we can enjoy her freely. <laughs> Take away. Shenley, don't be afraid. I'm coming to help you. How dare you kick my manhood? This is what would happen in Hai Sung. No one dare to offend me. Shenley. 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 Which day? Is that you? Make his manhood being cut down. Shirley? Shirley? How are you feeling? It's my fault to let you there. Were those men? Don't worry, I've ordered my men to give them a lesson. Before I lost my consciousness, I seemed to see Hoi Anto. You little fool, I'm the one who carried you. Can Ho Yan Zhou hold you with his lame leg? Yeah, he's a cripple. He's not gonna be able to hold me. Shelly, I don't know if I should say this. What? Grandpa has handed over Huo family to me, and Huo Yanjo is now unemployed. He hates me and thinks I took his place. He knew I asked you to go to that room to get something. So he sent someone to rape you and embarrass me. Huo Yanjo is such an asshole. Shelly. Surely, I'm just glad you're okay. Thank God you got there in time. Mr. Huo, Lu Jiexing is clearly talking nonsense. Miss Shen is completely deceived by him. Let's expose him. That's not necessary. Why, Mr. Huo? Lu Jiexing is insulting you. What would matter if I did? Shaoli won't trust me anymore. Hu Yanzhou, if you're not such a beast who hurt Shaoli so much, how could she forget you? He is a creeper. He's not gonna be able to hold me. Shen, I can hold you. Just walk a little slow. Why so careless? It doesn't matter. Just a little juice. Wait a minute, I'll get you something. Can you wear this tonight? Sorry, I'm going home now. Sleep here tonight. My dad put me on curfew. I need to go. What's wrong? Are you afraid I'll do what I did to you last time? Chi Tang, what are you talking about? Why are you still pretending? Didn't you remember everything? When did you find out? 
You can't fool people with the eyes, especially when you're sick of me. What are you going to do now? Hurt me like last time? Or use me to humiliate Huo Yan Cho? That's not funny. Let's have some fun this time. You have such a good skin. If I carve your face to create bloody flowers, wouldn't it look better? You're committing a crime. <laughs> a crime? If you'd volunteer, then it wouldn't count. Bastard. I just want to make you like a work of art and show you to Huo Yanzhou. What's your deep grudge against Huo Yanzhou? Everything you've done has been directed at him, such as Chiang Yan and me. He even took away Huo family group's inheritance. Huo Yan Zhou hurt you so much and you're still defending him. Have you forgotten what he did to you? Let's talk about the facts. Everything Huo Yan Zhou does is justified, and you are just an illegitimate bastard son. You are not like him at all. Gone. Say it. When I send the video of your scandal to Huo Yan Zhou, I'll let him know what a loyal dog you are. Hi? Shenley, if you want your father to be safe, you'd better keep your mouth shut. What did you do to my father? Don't be nervous. He was careless. Just need something. You are a psycho! See you at the wedding in five days. Do you really want to marry Lu Zhesheng? Why not? I'll marry you, cripple. I can be cured. I've already contacted the best doctors abroad. I'll leave soon. Why don't you come with me? Don't mind me. You'll be a cripple even if you are cured. You like to talk about me like that. Remember to come to the wedding later. If you don't come, how can I show off my happiness? I will do the whatever you want. Mr. Lu Jiesheng, do you take Miss Chen Li to be your wife? In sickness and in health, whether poor or rich, or for any other reason, love her and care for her honor her and accept her excuse me before we start the wedding today i have a gift to give to my good brother Ho yan jo this gift will make your life unforgettable of course everyone will also enjoy the video jesheng you can't fool around at the wedding. He is a pervert, isn't he? How could he do this to a woman? He treated the bride so badly. That's terrible. Too bad. Wow, this person is too perverted. I did not expect Lu Jiesheng is this kind of person. How dare you do this to my precious daughter? You son of a bitch. Turn it off now. This is the gift. I don't know if the brother likes it. Lu Jiesheng, madman! You switched the video? I did. Just for such a man as Huo Yan Zhou, you could even sacrifice your dignity? I really don't understand. But considering the way Huo Yan Zhou has been treating you, don't you hate him? I don't get it. So you've seen how he was trampled and toyed with. Don't you find Huo Yan Zhou like this? It's very disgusting. That year, when he and I were kidnapped. If it weren't for him who protected me, now the protagonist in the video should have been me. Why would I think of him as a loser? It's Chiang Yan who gave you the video, right? Of course. Isn't all of this the weakness of Hu Yan Zhou? Where is Chiang Yan right now? Chiang Yan? Chiang Yan? Hey, what are you doing? Hey, what do you want? Take him to the police station. Shen Li, we are both the abandoned. We are two of the same kind. Shen Li. <laughs> <laughs> what does Hu Yan Zhou deserve you for? What does he deserve you for?
Mr. Huo, do you need to think it over? I gotta propose. I'd love to. But will you marry me again? Oh, I don't have any ring. I got to buy it right now. He can propose with a rose. Carry me in your arms. Thank you.